Here is the Shadow King King Nazri, and I'm here with another update on Dragon Ball Z Xenoverse. Now, uh, a day or so, uh, say a day or so ago, we just got a new trailer for a dra for the game, and it showed off some of the fighting styles of all the characters, at least just, at least the ones that have been revealed so far. And aside from the GT stuff, we all know I don't like GT. It was awesome. Oh boy. In fact, I need to put my shades on. <laughs> oh boy. I mean, we saw Goku, uh, being Goku, doing his Kaioken, his Kamehameha, all you know who Goku is. And, uh, so, so Nappa, uh, uh, being a power, being a powerhouse, and you know, taking it out to a lot of people. Uh, Piccolo, uh, one interesting thing he did was doing this one move where he would spin around and have his arm stretched, so it seemed like it would be some kind of tornado attack. Kind of reminded me of about Liu Kang from Mortal Kombat. And let's see what uh, there was also another awesome part was uh, when the custom characters. Uh, specifically, this female Majin uh, was was fighting Nappa, and it grabbed it, grabbed it by the tail. So, and I think that uh, I might be wrong about this, but I think that the custom characters might have some uh, quick time events. Now, before you guys get started, get uppity, because we all know last time we had quick time events. Authentically, we did have one in Battle Z, but. More prominently, we had an Ultimate Tenkaichi, and that was not a good game. But if done right, it could be interesting. So I was thinking that uh, what that Mafia Majin was about to do was about to lift Nappa by the tail and toss him around. And if that's the case, damn. Just damn. Uh, we got to see other characters do their cut. Do other specials, uh, TM, Yancha. Oh, let's talk about Yancha. Uh, even when he gets the spotlight, he, they, we still couldn't help ourselves but expose that he was a complete failure. Because by the end of his spotlight, he gets caught by the Cyberman and explodes. Oh, Yancha, you are useless. <laughs> oh, but I can't, I can't. And speaking of kidding, did you guys see my boy Kid Boo? Oh, Kid Boo, <laughs> uh, throwing his Planet Buster, using uh, parts of his body to uh, to trap his enemies and do crazy, do insane, very quick attacks to uh, to overpower his opponents. It's not since Dragon Ball Z Budokai 2 that seeing Boo just proved just how dangerous he can be. That is one of the many reasons Kid Boo was my favorite villain in not only anime and manga, but in fiction, period. <laughs> and uh, the other villains got their spotlights, such as Frieza, uh, who's, who's, uh, when he was in his 100% form, uh, and Toa and Mira used their dark energy to boost his power. It seems like his muscles were building up, so is he going to get like a 200% form or whatever? You know, uh, so, uh, well, we just pretty much just saw him, uh, find the tournament and do his solo comment on high, and yeah, all the characters do their ultimate attacks. And we even had this little tidbit, uh, from Dragon Ball Z Battle of the Gods, where, uh, we, saw, we got to see Vegeta fight. So, yeah, this is going to highlight all the spots of, of uh, Dragon Ball Z Battle of the Gods, with Beerus fighting most of the Z fighters, then you'll get a turn with Vegeta versus Beerus, and then it'll be Super Saiyan God Goku versus Beerus, and yeah, you might even get to see uh, Goku fight on fight on a Kai planet where he fights Beerus. Now, will we see do it on King Kai's planet, or just be lazy and just do use the Supreme Kai world? Is that hope? I hope they use King Kai's plan, because we haven't seen that before. That'd be nice. But all in all, this was a pretty epic trailer. 
I was starting to get uh, some of the latest news was starting starting to disappoint me uh, with the inclusion of GT characters, uh, the fact that the custom characters won't get a Super Saiyan three or the other custom characters won't get a transformation per per se like your uh, as your more known well known counterparts like Frieza, Cell, and Boo. Uh, and uh, the worst news of all was that uh, in the main story, Broly is going to be the final villain, even though we had we just went through Cell, Boo, and Beerus, and this uh, new villain Demigra, who are obviously more powerful than Broly. But that's not here. But that's that's just a whole other story. Let's just focus on the positives. Uh, all in all, great trailer, love the gameplay, brought a lot of surprises, and I'm uh, really looking forward to this game. Hopefully by next week I'll have uh, the game fully paid off and I can just wait until I get it. So, uh, next video, I'm going to be talking about the Fantastic Four trailer. Yeah.